Hello everyone, my name is Anders, and today we are playing I Am Bread. And I realize I'm a little bit late to the toast party, but that's okay. I just want to record a commentary and talk about some random stuff. And since this game is random, I figured they would be paired together quite well. And I'd like to start this conversation by first addressing some of the issues or concerns or things people have said in the comment section, whether it be this video or previous videos. And I think that for the most part, comments are great and I appreciate your support, but there's always those bad apples, the people that kind of just ruin it for everyone, which is a bummer because I feel like people should police themselves and they should be held accountable for the things they say and they do. And, and I don't really block or ban people pretty much at all because, you know, ultimately if people want to say something, they can say something. But then I realized the other day, I'm like, this is my channel. <laughs> it's like if you go into a restaurant and somebody like whips down their pants and starts peeing on things, you'll be like, sir, well, first of all, why are you doing that? <laughs> Second of all, you need to leave. This is my establishment. And it just, I, I had this like aha moment where, you know, I've been doing this for so long that I've just sort of maybe uh, more or less just kind of become desensitized to all the sort of like, you know, haters out there. But for the most part, I think I'm going to start just blocking people and banning people and, and sort of defending my space, which is something that I've not really done because I felt like I didn't want to be the aggressor. I just wanted people to just kind of do what they wanted to do. But this is my shop and I don't want people to pee all over my things. <laughs> so I hope you guys understand. And I think it's actually a very positive thing. I know when we talk about banning or, or sort of blocking, it's like, oh, God, no. But it's like, if you don't like me or my content, it's what are you, what are you doing here? <laughs> There's so many other things you could do to occupy your time. And if you're part of the group that actually is supportive and is super dope and you're great people, then just keep on keeping on because that's exactly what I want here. So things are going to change. That's the first part of the conversation. I hope that was received well. And if not, I, I can do nothing. So there you go. <laughs> so let's move on to the conversation. I want to talk about some other stuff that's really exciting to me that I've been working on recently. I just kind of want to share this. And, and that is the conversation of merch. Uh, a lot of you guys know I've used Spreadshirt in the past, and for the past month or so, Kathy and I, Kathy is my girlfriend for those who don't know, we've been dating for about four years, uh, she has a channel, and I will put a link in the description below, and uh, we spent the last month or so actually going out and speaking to garment manufacturers, uh, both in LA and outside of LA, to try to figure out uh, what is the process from sort of conception to this finished product of a custom piece of clothing. So that could be a t-shirt, a button-up tee, uh, pants, jackets, sweaters, and also the uh, the screen printed tees, which I'm sure you guys have seen YouTubers sell on a variety of websites. And I think the main reason, I, I know from, you can probably tell from my wardrobe and videos, I, I like what I like and I don't typically uh, have flashy clothing. I just like it very simple. I like it very practical. And when I decide what I want to wear for the day, I want it to just be simple, well-made, just chill. I don't want to think about, you know, do I need to wash it in this or do that or blah, blah, blah. There's, there's all of these sort of like nuances when it comes to fashion. Whether you're, you're a man or a woman, you know that it can get pretty complex if you're willing to do that. So I want to actually manufacture just sort of very practical, essential, basic clothing. And I want it to be very well-made products down to the stitching and the fabric and the printing and everything you choose to do, uh, the buttons, I mean, the pockets, all these things. And I think that it's super exciting that I'm now going to create my ideal sort of like, I'm gonna be a clothing designer, which is kind of crazy. Not just like t-shirts and jackets. And what, what happens is when you buy merch, and I, I'm not knacking anybody who chooses to do this, by all means, I know what I'm proposing is a lot of work to a lot of different people. And I'm not saying that buying graphic tees is bad. I'm just saying that I would like to be a clothing designer. I'd like to be able to manufacture custom pieces of clothing because that's what excites me. It's like I get to go down to the factory and do quality control. And, and also too, I get to pass on the savings to the consumer. Because right now when you work with whatever company it is you choose, I mean, they're taking their cut for both the manufacturing and the fulfillment of those goods. And, and the thing is, is that you can actually save and pass that on. So it's like, let's say whatever merch website is going to say, oh, well, we're going to take X dollar amount per t-shirt for you to use our service. I'm just removing that and saying, listen, me and my people are going to both manufacture and ship the goods ourselves, which is super cool. It's like, if you get something from me, it actually came from me. And early on, you will probably get a package that I put together myself because I'm, I want to learn. I want to get involved. I don't want to just be that guy on the sideline who says, oh, I'll let somebody else handle it because I don't feel that's a good way to grow as a person or as a business. And that's what I'd like you guys to take away from this conversation is to say that, you know, well, listen, it's like if you want something done, just do it. And whatever it takes, just stay on it. Like, that's the thing. If you want to get to anywhere in life, you got to just be like focused, like laser focused, like this is what I'm going to do. This is my plan. And now I'm going to execute. So guys, I want to thank you for watching. By all means, if you want to share your thoughts on the comment section, the general sort of uh, stance I have on kind of like how I'm addressing these things and even clothing too. Like, 
What sort of clothing do you like? Do you prefer shirts, pants, shorts, sweatpants, socks? Like, what are you into? Let me know. And then if you guys have suggestions for, you know, what do you want printed on a graphic tee? Like, things like that. Anything you guys want to share, give your feedback in the comment section below. Guys, thanks for watching, and I will see you again very soon.